Today I'll be reviewing the Marvel Legends Marvel's Guardian. This was a gift from my mom. Thank you. Front of box, side of box, picture of Guardian. Back to box, same picture, and a lineup for the west of the Wendigo wave. And we get a little bio. Donning the maple leaf of his home, James Hudson suits up in advanced battle armor and protects the Earth as Guardian. I'm the Guardian. Guardian is also basically Captain Canada, and he leads Alpha Flight, which is basically X-Men and Avengers for Canada. Canada! Oh, Canada. Guardian can also shoot lasers from his hands and fly. So I guess he's more like Captain Burden than Captain America. Open him up, I accidentally somehow took out the plastic front of the box. Whoops. He comes with the torso and tail of the Wendigo. And if you're wondering about that, it's if you buy the entire wave, you get a free figure, a build a figure or collect and connect for buying the entire wave you get a Wendigo figure. Unless you use eBay and buy the parts, but that's cheating. Look at him outside the box and he's looking really nice. Except for his expression on his face, he looks pissed off about something. His paint's actually really, really good for Hasbro Marvel Legend. The white is this kind of pearlescent white, looks really nice. The red's really clean, and yes, they did indeed paint the maple leaf on his chest, up his torso, and back his torso, so there's not a gap in case you bend his torso. Hole in the back, so if you have a flight stand. He is a Marvel legend, so he has the pinnacle of what is modern standard articulation. He can do basically whatever pose you can even think about. He doesn't have any accessories to himself, so size comparison time. Here he is with the Marvel Legends Ant-Man from Ant-Man the Wasp. I'll get around to reviewing him. Here he is with Earthrise Astro Train, which I got around the same time. Also a future review target. Here he is with fellow Canadian Marvel Legends Rhino Wave Deadpool. And here he is with DC Universe Classics All-Star Batman. I really like this Guardian figure. He might not be, like, the perfect figure for some, but as a guy who likes obscure characters like Guardian, I like him. And I like Canada, so, yeah, I recommend it. You know the Canadian version of Great Value is called No Name Brand? And they come in these bright yellow boxes? That's kind of weird, isn't it?